Let's create a new user account in Windows Vista. To do this, first we need to go to the control panel. Click the start button and then choose control panel. Let's bring this window into view for you. Locate user accounts and family safety and choose add or remove user accounts. Enter your password and username if Windows user account control prompts you to do so. OK, in the next window you see, choose create a new account. On the next screen, choose a name for your account. This is usually the name or nickname of the person who is going to use it. Then choose an account type. Normally it is only necessary to have one administrator's account. So choose standard user for all the accounts for the rest of your family. When you are finished choosing these options, click on create account. OK, the account is now created. We should set a password for this account. Click on the account we just created and now click create a password. Now enter a password and confirm it here. You can also optionally enter a password hint to help jog your memory if you can't remember the password. We recommend using a stronger password than I'm using here for this example. Alternatively, rather than filling out this form yourself, call over your user or family member and get them to do it for you. That way, they will be able to create a password and a hint that is memorable only to them. When you have finished filling out this form, click on Create Password. OK, this account is now fully configured. You can exit the Account Manager Next time you log off or restart your computer, you will be able to select this account and start using it.